have you seen videos like this and you see animation ai you create these things and they are able to work like this and you are wondering like how do people actually do all these things you can make these things talk you can make them walk around the truth is as ai continues to grow this is the world many people are being entertained with ai if you go to instagram tiktok you see so many ai videos that people spend time watching because it's entertaining them you can make so much money with these things there is no need for me to go and be showing you channels where people are making money over commerce the most important thing is you learning these skills using it to impact our generation like you're create video like this impacting children you create videos like this impacting lives and making money in the process it brings so much fulfillment so today i'm going to be walking you through five different steps how to do this i'm going to show you how to generate your videos i'm going to show you how to create the prompt make the ai videos keep them consistent i'm going to show you how to create the story generate images for the story keep them consistent i'm going to show you how to make voice over i'm going to show you how to make this things talk how to make them move and how to put everything together so let us head over to chat gpt let's start from there you can use any software if you already have your story go ahead and write it and especially if you already have a story you can take that story and then bring it to ai to refine it for you that's exactly what i'm going to be doing so i have a story here I'm talking about three characters and I've already described their dressing in my prompt. I'm describing that the boy is wearing red, the girl is wearing blue and I've described how her dress should look and the dog that is also there is blue dog. So I've created, I've made all those descriptions to help make my story unique and in this story, these children, they are going to look for a cross. You know, that is the most important thing. You can use these things to impact our children as they grow up. So if you want to impact those children with knowledge, about the Bible right you can use AI to do that so now they are going to look for the cross and so they are going to go throughout this journey to go and look for this cross at a particular place so now I've just given that prompt like that and I'm just going to click enter and chat GPT is going to write that story for us and chat GPT is going to do everything for us so I've asked chat GPT to give me prompts to generate a story I've also asked chat GPT to give me the narration of the story and then I've also asked chat GPT to give me dialogue so if you one you can do them one at a time but i'm just going to do all at the same time because i want to make it simpler but that's how you can go about it so chat gpt is going to go ahead and write our story for us that is it chat gpt is doing it of our commas imagine we are in the ai era so nobody should not have this knowledge there is no reason why we should not understand these things if you have a phone take the time and learn these things it is the way forward just imagine few years back when ai was not here now ai does this for us so let's take advantage of it now our story is here everything is here now i'm just going to go and look for where my prompts are and then we are going to go from there so i'm going to go ahead i'll copy the first prompts just like this and then i'm going to go to leonardo and show you how to design it now let's go to leonardo and then we'll see how to create our images so you can use any ai platform if you don't have leonardo i'm going to have a link down below and Leonardo, you, you are going to have free credit. Everything we are doing here, you can do it completely for free. So when you come to Leonardo, you see where it says image creation, or you can also click here where it says image creation. You just click like that, and then it's going to open this place. Now go ahead and paste your prompt like right there. That's our prompt, and then you go ahead and click here and generate. So Leonardo is going to generate our prompt for us. So after our images are generated, you can look at it and see if there are things that you like. If you have any problem with it, you can go ahead and change it. So this is what I want. The dog, the girl, and then with the boy, just like that. I had already generated these images for this story, so that will make it easier for us. Now the next thing that you are going to do is that when you have generated that first image, what I want you to do is to come here. You see these three lines. You see what it says, copy seat. You go ahead and copy the seed just like that another thing that you can do if you have the free version this is what you are going to do if you have the pay version if you have the pay version you are just going to come here click here on this thing and then you are going to see image to image you click here now you are going to go and upload the image that you want to upload so you want them to be like this image so this is just something to keep it consistent so you are just going to come here and then you upload it just like this. Now the image is going to come here. So what happens is that it's going to keep the style, keep everything consistent. 
and look at i'm using this one that says phoenix 0 0.9 that's what i'm using here and then i have it here on fast and i have it here on 16 by 9 because it's youtube and i have it on large and i have it on four so those are the settings that i have here so four just means it's going to give me four different images every time now that you've had your image uploaded and you have your seat right there so let me show you what to do with the seat when you copy that seat you are going to come here where it says advanced and then you paste it here use fix seat now you are going to paste that seat right here so this is going to help to keep everything consistent. So now what I'm going to do is that I'll go back now to chat GPT and now I'm going to copy the next prompt. So now I'm just going to copy the next prompt and then I'm going to paste it and I'll generate it. So one thing too that I want to show you here, after this prompt is over, I'm going to show you something that you need to do to be able to keep everything consistent. After you generate your images just like this, everything is here. You look at it and see how you are generating your images they are so cute now the next thing that i want you to do is that every time you copy this prompt you copy it in order for you to keep it consistent right you come here you paste your prompt just like that so you come here wherever you see daniel you just describe daniel that he's wearing red you just make sure you write daniel dressed in red you describe him his shoes you can go and copy his prompt and just paste it here you go ahead wherever you see elijah elijah is a dog you go ahead you describe elijah everything about him and then you go ahead you take the girl miriam you go ahead and also describe her after you've described them like that now you start generating your images is going to help to keep everything consistent now after you've generated all your images these are all the images that i have generated for my story there are so many of them look at how consistent look at how beautiful these images are they look so consistent now i'm just going to go ahead come here just like this and then you go ahead and download any of the images that you want so you just click here and then you are going to download you go ahead and look at them so every time you have four like this you go ahead and click them based on your story you go ahead and download it make sure that of course it's ai there are some things that maybe will not be exactly what you want you go ahead and just make sure you take the ones that really match your story so i'm just going to go ahead and select everything that i need and then i'm going to download them now the next thing that we have to do is to go ahead and create our voice over so now if you want the characters to talk you can just come and ask chat gpt to give you dialogues for them short short dialogues now i've just asked chat gpt to give me short dialogues for each and every one of them now chat gpt has given us dialogue for daniel miriam and then elijah so you can just go ahead and copy it like this let's start with daniel i'm going to copy daniel and then chat gpt has also given that for the narrator so what we are going to do is that you are going to go now to 11 lap let's go ahead and open that so we are going to go to 11 lap just like this and then if you don't have an account you create one if not you just start for free and then i'm going to put the link of everything i'm talking about down below now when you come here you see where it says text to speech you click on that text to speech now you are just going to go ahead and paste whatever you want daniel to say right here now you come here where you have voices you can search for cartoon voices if you want to if you want a specific voice you can go ahead and search for it now just look here there are so many voices search for any one that you want try them and see which one that you like and when you see the one that you like you go ahead and then you click on it just like that and then you add the voice and after you've added the voice you are now just going to go and then select the particular voice that you want you select the voice that you want and then you come here to where it says generate you generate just like that so you go ahead and just generate the voice just like that after you've generated a voice you come here where you see this download you click here and then you are going to download the file you do the same for all your characters you come choose their voices go ahead and do the same thing for your narrator and choose everything and then you create every file you download them just like this so you can go ahead and create a file where you can name everything you can put all their voices label them for the boy you can put d1 
so daniel 1 first voice d2 second voice d3 so all the dialogues for daniel you can put them like that the same thing for the girl you do the same thing for the dog and the same thing for the narrator so we've written our story which is number one we've made our images number two we've created our voices number three now the fourth thing is that we are going to take our images and make them into videos so this is a website we are going to be using you can use runway i've shown you already how to use runway i'm going to put a video here i've shown you many different ai's how you can convert your images into videos now is very common i hope you already know something if not go ahead and use this one so we are going to click like this and then it's going to bring us here so when you create an account it's going to give you some free credit that you can use so what I want you to do is that you come here and just click here. Take any of your images that you want. Let's say, for example, you go ahead and take an image like that. You just upload it just like this. And now whatever action that you want these people to be doing, you can go to ChatGPT, copy the prompt, and then just come and paste it here. I've just said that the AI should make them walk in. And now I'm just going to click here. It's going to be 30 credit. And then it's going to generate it so just watch and see what will happen here you can say maybe make them talking whatever thing that you want you can go ahead and just do that if they were cooking you tell the ai to make them cooking if they were dancing can you imagine look at that look at that look at that this is just so amazing how you can take that still image and turn into something like this look at how like it looks so good it looks so good so after you've done that the next thing i want you to do you see where it says speech you just click here and then come down here also where it says speech you make sure you are on that sometimes i don't know so before when i checked it it had like lip sync now come here where it says upload go and upload your audio so if you want the girl to talk in your prompt you could also say the girl is talking so that this will easily catch it right if you want the boy you go ahead and just take it like this and now we upload it just like this now after you upload it you listen to make sure that it is the right character that you want and now you generate just like this so remember the voices the dialogue that you had taken you can take them now and put them here and make them to talk so it's going to take some time and then after it's very fast actually after i finish generating then you go ahead and do the same thing for all your images upload them like this those that you want to make them talk you do the same thing and those that you want just the images you go ahead and do just the images so now that we are done look at the boy's mouth you hear him speaking let's see almost there i can feel something amazing waiting for us look we're almost there i can feel something amazing waiting for can you imagine now it sings the lips so this audio that we created in 11 lab we are able to make them walk and talk at the same time overcomers it's time for everyone to step on this thing even if you just want to train the children how to do this thing it is the way forward we don't have to waste so much time struggling on things trying to think things you just need to have the idea and then you put it into action so after you have done all of that you've generated your images you make them to talk some of them you don't need to make them talk at all the places because the narrator will also be narrating right so now you come here and then just download it like this so after you have downloaded you go ahead and do the same thing for all your images now the next thing is for us to go ahead and put it together as a video in order for us to edit our video we are going to use CapCut. you can use any edit editing software that you have so now go ahead if you don't have CapCut, i'm going to put a link down below now go ahead and just come here after you've created an account you see where it says upload right here you say upload file you can come now and upload all your videos that you have generated so these are all our videos that we have generated you come and then you just click open and then it's going to upload them everything here into CapCut. After you upload them to CapCut, your videos will all be here like this. Then I've also uploaded the narration for the narrator. Now I'm going to arrange them one after the other according to my story. I'll just arrange them like this. Arrange them just like this. Organize it to the need of my story. Arrange everything in order. And then after I've arranged everything, the places where the narrator has to speak, I'm just going to take only the narrator's voice and then I'm going to put under the video just like this. I'm going to take the narrator's voice and put under the video just like this. So when they are going... Daniel, Miriam, and Elijah set off on an exciting adventure to find the cross. So they are going like this. 
and then i'll put everything and lined up everything to match my story now after i've done all of that the next thing i'm going to do i'll come here to transition any transition that i want to use i'll just take it and then put here just like that so you can see the transition just like this to find the cross so you see the transition if i don't like that one i'll take it out any transition that i want i'm just going to take it just like this and i'll put it here the cross they ran through so then after that another thing that i can do is that i'll come here and take any effects so any effect that is here that i want i'm just going to take it and then put it to on my story just like that they ran through golden fields explored deep so you see what happened how that effect just moving like that it makes your story looks like really really as if it was edited by a professional but you are just taking things from CapCut here and putting after you are done with everything you just also look for your music so i'll advise that if you want to post this you can go you can use free music from youtube library i've already made this video showing you how to do that i personally use epidemic sound so i'm going to put the link down below in case you are interested so i don't like to create my video and then i go and take free music somewhere and put on my video and then at the end maybe i'm not able to monetize because i use music that was not mine you can also use suny you can also use ai to create your music and put it on your videos if you think that's what you want to do so you can just go ahead look for any music that matches your song matches your story and then you take that music too and then you just put it just like this so the last thing is just to put music where necessary you just go ahead and take the music and then you put after you are done with everything then you listen to your video over and over and see if you need any changes when you are done you come and click here where it says export if everything is perfect you come here where it says download now you just come here i like to change the quality because you don't want to spend your time and then post something that is not high quality i like to take this one and then also your frame you can just go ahead and play with these settings take it like this and then mp4 then you just go ahead and export it just like this now it's going to export your video for you and your video is ready you can take it now and post it on any platform so let's go ahead and watch the video we just made daniel miriam and elijah set off on an exciting adventure to find the cross they ran through golden fields explored deep forests and climbed tall hills never giving up look we're almost there I can feel something amazing waiting for us. This place feels special, like we were meant to be here. Every challenge they faced, they trusted God to lead the way. In a glowing clearing, they saw it, the cross shining bright, waiting just for them. As they reached out, a warm light filled their hearts. So overcomers, thank you so much for watching this video to the end. Hopefully you learned something. Go ahead and impact life. Go and change generations. The amazing thing is that now that you've had this video, how can you make money with this? This video that you've created, like this, you can use it to make money in many different ways. You can use it for affiliate marketing. You, when you have this idea, you can create TikTok, Instagram, any of those things, right? Pinterest, take your affiliate marketing products, take your print on demand products, and then just post them with these things. As you grow your audience, that is how you are also going to grow your money so by come and go ahead and impact lives while making money in the process go ahead and click on this next video that will walk you step by step another business model that you can start you can go ahead and check the description box down below any information that you need if you have not liked this video up to this point go ahead and give it a thumbs up subscribe and become a part of the family and i'm going to see you in the next video it's been a while since we laid down Reflect upon